Guys, what's going on? Today I'm gonna to be doing something a little bit different. I'm gonna be doing a review of the Vortex Optics VIP warranty. A lot of guys run Vortex because of the price point and because they say the warranty is super easy to use and super easy to do. I've never personally used the warranty. I've never had to until now. But I have these binoculars here. They're the Viper HD 10x42s. I have run and beat these binoculars for almost five years. And in all that time, the only thing that's happened, the only thing that's gone wrong with them is this eye cup right here, this twist up eye cup. Uh, the rubbers come loose and the threads are kind of stripped to where it doesn't want to go up and down. That's just from probably neglect on my part. But the Vortex VIP warranty covers all that stuff. And, um, and I'm gonna send them in and I'm gonna see uh, how long it takes to get them back, um, what the warranty covers, how easy it is to do it. But I wanna show you guys the whole process. So I'm just Googling Vortex VIP warranty. The first thing that comes up is the Vortex site. So if you click below, it'll tell you Vortex service. So here's the return procedure. So basically it's gonna give you the service request form. So it's super simple. This is the service request form. I don't know if you'll be able to see that or not. Um, and all you need to do is you print that out and you put that in the box with um, your optic when you send it back. And then it gives you here um, a warranty. And it gives you an address right there on the screen. So it says, uh, attention VIP warranty, 2120 West Greenview Drive, Middleton, uh, Wisconsin, 53562. So then it says they'll evaluate it and replace it, um, or repair it based on what they think is best. So turnaround time will vary, but they'll do their best to get it back to you quickly. So that's kind of a rundown on all you need to do. you go to their website, it shows you the address. And so now that I have the information that I need, um, I'm gonna print off the service request form. Um, I'm gonna take these to the post office. I'm gonna ship them to that address right there. And uh, I'll update you guys how long it takes to get them back and the kind of job they did on them. And um, I'll let you guys know. So stay tuned. and 60 cents to send them to Wisconsin. So I think that'll be worth it. Few days. All right, this is part two of the Vortex VIP warranty review. Today is July the 20th. Um, I just got home from a little trip and my package arrived uh, July 19th. So I sent it in July 6th to the 19th. Um, that's how long it took to get my binoculars back from Vortex. That's pretty quick if you ask me. So I'm pretty impressed with the speed right off the bat. Um, but they're here and we're gonna open them up. We're gonna see how they look, what kind of a repair job they did on them, and uh, let you guys know what the value of this warranty really is. There they are. Open them up and see what they look like. They look really clean. The lenses look good. The eye cups look good on them and everything. Everything really looks good. The issue I was having with the eye cups twisting up and down, fixed, 100%. So, there it is. So all in all, my binoculars were gone from July 6th to July 19th. So that's a total of 13 days, just under two weeks. And I'd say that's 100% worth it. I've honestly been putting them off a little bit for a long time because I was worried about how long it was gonna take and how long I was gonna be able to live without them. I use my binoculars all the time. So that's a pretty sweet value to me. You think about the price of your optics, how much you're spending. To have that assurance that they're gonna be back to you in just a few weeks, that seems like a pretty good value to me. So you guys can check out Vortex Optics. I'll put a link in the description to Vortex's website. Um, if you guys wanna learn more about their warranty or if you wanna buy some optics, it's, uh, it's a great way 
I, I've been using them for years and I really like them. Also, you guys, let me know in the comments if you like these kind of reviews or not, or if you have any products that you want me to look at and review. Um, I'd be happy to check them out and do some more of these if it's something that you guys want to see more of in the future.